you know, if you're in the like space and looking for people's predictions, some people have some pretty uh, insanely bullish, uh, you know, <laughs> optimism, uh, hopium, I would say, is a good one. But yeah, generally, yeah. like if we are going to stick to this logarithmic scale that we've seen, uh, then I would say like $130,000, $140,000 is, yeah, li- so is likely going to be the top next time around. Yeah, it's like, that is like, if, if uh, so looking at, at previous cycles, like it tends to top out, like basically the, the bull market starts after the Bitcoin halving event yeah. happens. Um, and then it, it sort of goes on uh, for about a year. So it usually tends to end around December. So yeah. say the halving is scheduled to start in like April. End of April. Yeah. Next year. Yeah. End of April next year. It's probably going to keep chopping around here at the base of this uh, this line here. And then it'll start its parabolic move. As you can see, like every time it does that, it goes into a parabola. So like if the parabola starts and then it peaks around like the end of 2025, uh, which will be uh, here. Yeah. Or yeah, yeah, which is uh, basically, I I think it'll go on to like 2026, right? Like the beginning of 2026, the end of 2025. Yeah, I imagine uh, so too. It's probably going to be less of a so, like steep uh, pointy top. Like this, this more recent one was also starting to be more of a flatter top. Much, yeah, much longer chance to exit. Like the first, yeah, exactly. The first few bull markets, like those high prices, they were there for like a day or two days tops, and then they turned, <laughs> you know recently. But then uh, this time around with with Bitcoin and Ethereum, we had the chance to cash in at the top f- for like a month or two. Yeah, is, I think. I think like basically like we we had a a double top I think basically yeah, we had a double top text so double top, yeah so like double top here here and then like so uh so it could end so the if it's 2025 the end of 2025 the price would be around looking at this it's around yeah 125 125 130 k so like people are of course going to be very excited once we break the 100k no doubt and you know you're gonna probably hear all kinds of things saying that it's gonna go to a million million yeah. dollars or whatever it's and just meter your expectation i think it's always a good idea to have targets and then follow your plan as an investor you're making a plan you're following a strategy and our strategy is going to be you know obviously looking for the the blue lines that you have drawn out there as as uh, current support looking to kind of yeah. buy into some spot positions there and then i would say by the time we hit 110 120 thousand dollars i'm uh looking to sell a good good amount of it obviously not everything until we're confirming with another bear signal and moving down but yeah you know it's definitely a take profit target and uh you know, it's it's five times higher than the current spot price, so that's going to be massive profits, you know, trading on the way up. But it isn't, you know, fifty times what, uh, right, what you right. know, which is what people are kind of expecting sometimes. And uh, and and I think like that's the thing with like assets. Like I mean, uh, for long term wise, they tend to like volatility tends to reduce, and we're yeah. seeing that. Like you can see the the jump the first time around, and then it keeps getting less volatile. Yeah. And the, the pullback so is less intense. The like flat line, exactly. the, the jump up is less intense. Yeah, exactly. And I think we're gonna see it less volatile as like the years go by too. Um, yeah. So yeah, like all we have to do is kind of like uh, buy when it hits the bottom and then sell when it hits the top yeah but we have our indicator which basically confirms everything so yeah so right you know now, we basically that confirmation i want yeah to see that we've just been right. exactly because the indicator uh, it takes everything into account and like we just we basically trade with the indicator 